What is animal abuse? Thank you very much for that question. Animal abuse varies. It could be seen as hitting, pushing, shoving, unlawfully causing another living thing to suffer, non-human. And when you abuse an animal, it can very badly affect the animal's mental well-being. Exposing the animal to domestic abuse between household fights is also animal abuse. And illegal exports and even legal exports between animals and the treatments they are in, for example, unhygienic sanitation between animals, not receiving enough food, neglect, abandonment, physical cruelty, mental cruelty, screaming at the top of your lungs in their faces, shouting at them. I hope this helps as animal abuse is a very complex question to answer as it is a very big spectrum of different treatments animals can receive. Thank you very much for that question. What do you believe the legal impact and punishments should be to those who choose to abuse animals? Thank you very much for your question. I would like to begin by first updating you on the facts on animal cruelty. Those found at the worst cases of animal cruelty can be sentenced to up to five years in prison. I personally believe this isn't long enough and it should be, for example, 50 years for the worst cases of cruelty. Because not only is it morally wrong, it's illegal and it's a cowardly act because you're abusing something smaller than you because it can't speak out and it can't speak to people who come in about what's happening. And it's wrong and it's so hard to crack down on that the authorities need to be much stricter and give the RSPCA more powers to fourth century when they reasonably believe an animal is a threat and they should make it legal for you to be sentenced for up to 50 years in prison for the worst cases. Because, I mean, it's ridiculous that the current sentence just five years. It should be the same for what you would get if you killed someone or hurt someone the same way. Thank you very much for your question. What do you think of people who abuse animals? Firstly, I think they're cowards and they're just sick people. They're just sick and they need to be sentenced to life in prison, I believe. They're just cowards and sick, and they're too scared to do it to somebody bigger than them. Because I bet you they wouldn't start it with a five-foot man on the street if they were four-foot. Bet you they wouldn't. Thank you very much for your question. News reporter Dwayne Hards, WCN News.